welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be reviewing these Uhuhu watercolor brush pens they sent to me. Let's see how this experience is going to go. I'm going to open it and then we'll take a look at these. Okay, let me show the packaging first. This is what it looks like. Oh, well, there it is. Pretty fancy. Some flowers. And then it just comes out like that. How pretty. I'm just going to put this on the side. It's like comes with this big old brush pen. One of those Pentel brush pens. And this is what the pens look like. It comes to a very nice point, so that's pretty cool. Alright, so I have water in here. Let's go ahead and swatch these. I don't know if I'm supposed to wet this first. I didn't even see if there was color names. So there's no color names on these. Not that I can see. On the cap, nope, no color names. But it's actually laying down pretty nicely. So I have that down. I'm going to take the water brush. Squeeze it a little bit and then... That looks super pigmented. Alright, let's try this orange. Okay, I might have squeezed a little bit too much water. Just a little bit. That looks, that looks, <laughs> I could have centered this at least. I mean, okay, we did a swatch. That's okay. That's okay. Ahulu usually makes like pretty bright colors, so I'm not surprised here. Look how pretty these colors are. All right, let me see if I can like blend these. Okay, I'm going to see if I can blend from there. Wow, that was pretty easy. <laughs> that was good. Well, look at that. Wasn't that a good blend? Let's see. What if we go from a purple to a pink? So we're going from this all the way to here I think <laughs> it's a little bit messy but it actually really did blend kind of there right there <laughs> you can easily pick up this color like that it kind of like sits on the paper I'm gonna see if I can activate this color again but let's take a look yeah I can and that's going to leave like a weird you know that watercolor look it's already showing there it might be a little bit hard for me to use since the color does lift from the paper and it lifts a lot oh this is a very pretty color though <laughs> but there's our swatch now i'm gonna just throw this paper away <laughs> i'm just kidding i'm gonna lose it i always lose my swatches i'm just gonna like draw something and it will color it but i don't know what i want to draw so i'm gonna check my instagram hashtag hashtag Lucid name. Eldritch Princess. All right, so this is from Eldritch Princess. Um, I really like the drawing. I like the glasses a lot. So I might have to add more colors in here so I can use a lot more of these. But this looks very cute. 
So thank you very much for using the hashtag. Let's start this drawing out. gonna use my micron all right so I'm done inking now it's time to color oh, the only possible skin tone here I thought this was a brown but you can see that doesn't really look like a brown though it kind of looks like a purple color. So I'm thinking maybe this orange I can lighten up. I don't really know how to color with this, but let's see how this goes. Got a color in her nose. Get my water brush. Dilute that. Here we go, I think this orange color will work as her skin tone. I'm gonna move on to her shoulders and everything else. Okay, so I'm done with her skin for now. I'm gonna move on to her lips. Let's see this red color here. I'm gonna dab directly on her mouth. And then we're gonna blend. Even though I'm gonna color them in. Okay, so I'm gonna color in her glasses. Ah, oh, that doesn't look too weird. Look at that. Oh my god, that looks so scary. Alright, so now we're gonna blend. I hope that don't look too weird. Okay, so her top piece here is pretty dark. So I'm gonna go in with this brown color. And then I'm gonna mix a little bit of that purple color in here. Should I add a little bit of red? <laughs> I guess this one's pink. And now I'm gonna take the water brush. I'm gonna try and mix all these colors together.
Her hair is pink, but this is like way too pink. And now I can't really take it back though. Alright, so this is what the final piece looks like. I decided to leave the line art that light color. I think it looks good. The glasses are really, really thick. But, yeah. So what I think about these. Alright, so I think these markers are pretty cool. They're a bit time consuming just cause like having to put a color down and then blend it out, put it down, blend it. That's just a bit time consuming. But besides that, they work pretty nice. The colors blended pretty well and they're really vibrant, so. But yeah, I will have a link in the description to where you guys can purchase this pen. That is pretty much it for today's video. I really wanna thank Eldritchie Princess for letting me draw her character. I know the hair came out a bit too pink. I didn't want it like that, but ah. Big mistake but i still hope you like this drawing and if you guys ever want me to draw your character use the hashtag lucidema on instagram and i'll find your post and draw it if i don't have anything else to draw so that is pretty much it for today's video thank you all so much for watching i hope you guys like today's video and i will see you all in the next one bye guys thanks for watching